All turning now to this, Fonnie Willis allowed to remain as prosecutor in former President Donald Trump's election interference case in Georgia. So the judge releasing his decision this morning, writing there was no conflict of interest, presenting Willis with two options. ABC's Perry Russom is in Washington. Today, a judge in Georgia ruling Fonnie Willis can remain as prosecutor in Donald Trump's election interference case. Trump's lawyers accused Willis of benefiting financially from hiring prosecutor Nathan Wade to her team, creating a conflict of interest. Willis said that wasn't true. I don't need anything from a man. A man is not a plan. Judge Scott McAfee writing Trump's team failed to meet their burden of proving that the district attorney acquired an actual conflict of interest in this case. But McAfee adds a significant appearance of impropriety infects the current prosecution team. The judge presenting Willis with two options. She may choose to step aside along with the whole of her office or special prosecutor Wade can withdraw. The timeline of the Willis-Wade relationship was in question, with Trump's team saying they started dating before he was hired. Both Willis and Wade testified their relationship started after. In November of 2021, I hired him. I do not consider our relationship to have become romantic until early of 2022. The judge writing neither side was able to conclusively establish when they became romantic. McAfee writing, an odor of mendacity remains. Trump has pleaded not guilty in this case. His lawyer released a statement after the ruling, writing they will use all legal options available as they continue to fight the case. They could appeal this decision, which could push a trial date further down the road. It could bump right up against the presidential election. Perry Russell, ABC News, Washington.